This is Austin's second day coming back and he's made two more welds today. And we're gonna go over them and just kind of show you the progress and I'm gonna give him some, some tips and some things to do to get past this one thing that's holding him up. So I'm gonna come up here and grab the camera and walk you through it. How are you looking? So, the top looks fine. Now we're not really gonna, we're not concerned about the cap right now. But you can tell uh, the bottom is always everybody's trouble in this dead man's curve, as they call it. But the main thing is the bead. Now, all the bead inside looks good on the sides and the top. Man, it looks real good, actually. I'll get this camera to focus. Oh, it doesn't want to focus. There it goes. When you get down to the bottom, you start seeing um, some suck back right there. Try to zoom in on it. Well, yeah, right there. All right, that's a little below flush. And what you can do, if that happens when you're on the job, you can just bend to 6010 like that and back weld it. Problem is, a lot of times, you don't have that luxury. Now this side, the same thing is, bead looks good on the top oh, yeah. and on the sides. When he gets down to the bottom, he's got the same IP, insufficient, but it's really, it's just sucked back mainly. So, what we're gonna do, get the camera back to okay. Jose. What we're gonna do next time, Austin, is we're gonna fit it up just like normal, put some tacks in it, and you're gonna weld the bottom the whole time. Okay. We're gonna weld the bottom, we're gonna roll the pipe, weld the bottom, we're gonna put all the bead in on the bottom. We're gonna focus on that one spot. And you know, manipulate the heat. I'm gonna work on your rod angle a little bit because there's a good chance your rod angle's probably not quite right. Because when you come around that bottom, you really kind of need to be like that, you know. You need to be leading it on the bottom or straight in. But um, we're gonna work on that bottom and everything else looks really good. Uh, there's come a long ways and maybe we'll do a 7018 uh, filler and cap on the next video so guys stay tuned we're gonna get this guy welding pipe sure shortly for sure so have an awesome awesome day we'll see you in the next one later